frame manufacture, and assembly. The files and data that control the Frame Master Roll forming machine are generated by FrameCAD Detailer and can be exported to the machine via a wired or wireless network or memory stick. The order in which panels and trusses are manufactured can be tailored to suit your construction schedule. Before each wall panel is manufactured, a drawing of the completed wall appears on the Frame Master controller screen, providing the operator and assemblers with a visual reference of what's being produced. The components of the wall are manufactured in a predetermined order to ensure the most efficient assembly sequence. Top and bottom plates, horizontal noggins and blocking are manufactured first. Then the studs are produced from left to right. This makes assembly faster and easier. Each component is printed as it is manufactured with details that identify how it is to be assembled. The company name, project name, time of manufacture or other unique information can also be printed on each component, allowing complete traceability as part of the FrameCAD quality system. FrameCAD's quality program helps to ensure that you produce steel framing that complies with international standards. It is critical that you inspect steel coils when you receive them into your factory and that you inspect the quality of product during and after the manufacturing process. The steel coil should be stored near the decoiler to minimize downtime when changing coils. A safe lifting system, such as this permanent gantry, should be used. Make sure that each time a new coil is loaded, it is first inspected and the coil information recorded. Most steel frame assemblers prefer assembly tables with a solid L backing frame secured to the ground. Trestles are placed inside the L to support the major steel framing components being produced. The trestles can be moved around to suit the size and shape of the panels being constructed. The framing is fixed together using specialist frame CAD screws in a strip fed screw gun. The table should be positioned in a way that allows assemblers to move freely around the assembly area without obstruction. It is vitally important that Frame Master operators keep an accurate record of every wall that is manufactured to ensure that house slots are fully complete before they're dispatched. Oversized walls that may be too large to be transported as one unit should be made in multiple sections or the components bundled together to be assembled on site.